It's ridiculous that you will be fining people for a word, for using a word, making a sound. It is absolutely ridiculous. On a lighter note, I suppose from a moral point of view, we should probably try and use it less, I suppose. I don't think it's a matter of free speech. I just think it's a matter of education and good manners. Mm -hmm. This is a fine because you want to keep the public space um, more polite. I guess. Yeah. The first thing controlling people's thinking is controlling people's language. No, I think it's been ridiculous. Like, like we won't be able to fart next because we're letting off too much methane gas. You know, like, <laughs> it's, get, get, yeah. it's getting to be real nanny state altogether. England is a battle zone. It's a war zone at the moment with people being raped, half stabbed, and they're talking about fine and you're first saying fuck. It's ridiculous. It's bullshit. But I do find, like, when a woman is telling a story or something or relating something, and she goes there with the air for drink. I find it so sexy and so Dear. erotic. Do you? Oh yeah, I do. You get, all, so do you, you, get a, you get a bit very turned on by the whole thing. There's nobody controlling my tongue because I will say what I want. Now, I don't swear all the time, but if I get really riled up or annoyed or passionate about something, oh yeah. Yeah. I let fly. Yeah. I saw John walking down the street and he was swinging his hip and say, "Look at that sexy fecker." Do you know what I mean? <laughs> <laughs> careful, careful. <laughs> That's the last thing I think you'd say if you saw John walking down the street in fairness. <laughs>